Right guys, Blackmore Vale RC here. It's arrived. 20 weeks in the making, it's here. I have one in the UK. Um, I'm not going to tell you. I've had to sort of sit down for half an hour because I have been shaking like a leaf and I am whooping my pants. Dying to get this thing out of the box. Because like everybody else, you've seen the videos. You've seen it on the YouTubes. Um until you actually see the size of the box it's it's quite surprising how large this thing is so let's get the lid off and uh, have a look inside shall we so we've got some manuals and some spare stickers there All right. let's, here we go <laughs> oh, I'm shaking. I'm absolutely shaking. That little bag of tools there. But this is the main event. Let's have a look. It's quite heavy. Oh my god. Oh dear. I am literally shaking. Oh. oh dear. Look at that. Twenty weeks waiting and I think it's been bloody worth it. Look at it. Can you guys see this? Thing is, it's it's quite heavy. It weighs three and a half kilos. Whew. Let's just plonk him there a minute. Get a stand. Some more spare parts. Huh? Battery rubbers. Offsets. I think the offset thing is for the um, chain tension then. Bag of bits. There's a stand to sit on. So let's get him out of that. He obviously sits on there like that. Got your starting stand. Batteries. Should be. Open them up. This is the 2S LiPo. Five thousand milliamp, fifty C, two S battery. Be a little charger in here, I suppose. Try not to cut my fingers off with a knife. <laughs> Diddy Diddy battery charger. Chain lube, the chain, and then the controller. This is the Spectrum DX3, specifically to this bike. You've obviously got your throttle there, flywheel on, different modes, front brake trim, steering sub trim, front brake travel, rate. On off button and then somewhere here there is a um, 
menu button there, you press that to um, change the modes. So that is all of that out and out box. Let's put that down there like that. Let's get Mr. over here so you can see him a bit better. Proper float in front disc brake like normal motorbikes. Real chain. It's been worth waiting for. It's the quality of the thing is it's amazing. So the issues we had with this was obviously trying to get them into the UK. Um, that's all sorted now because I've got mine I know a lot of people are still waiting but the um, the bike's amazing it is worth waiting for yeah proper Dunlop tyres they're quite firm as well break it before I even run it flippy up a bit that's really smart really smart really pleased with it right guys i'm gonna charge the battery up um obviously in the uk it's a weather's a bit crap which we'd expect in november middle of november so let's get it charged up and then we'll try and run it a bit later thanks guys if you like the content hit the subscribe button hit the like button see you on the next video